step uh, as far as securing just the tank is the bolt and the little thing that you use to prop up the tank with. Now, you know, obviously you go in reverse order if you're trying to tear it down, right? Um, so now let me put this on. Okay, now it's uh, on. So that's it. The tank's on secure. And uh, now we just have to put the plastics back on. Okay, so looking at the manual, um, you'd think reverse order would be uh, put on the tank covers first and then put the, uh, the uh, fuel tank front cover. But I've taken this off before um, and I'm going to put the front cover on first um, because... Um, it just doesn't, it lines up better that way with the tank covers. I just don't get it. But actually, I, to be fair to the manual, I, I didn't look at the reverse procedure. But I'm going to put on the uh, this guy first. And all it is is the cover and two little plastic guys. And how these guys work is pretty simple, right? Um, to release them, you're going to come across a couple of these. You just push down when it's on the unit itself and that releases it. Um, then you just push up when you're done, push up, plug it in and push it so it's flush, right? So again, um, when you're trying to get it off, it's going to be flush like that, right? It'll be flush. And then you just push down with a pin or your nail or whatever, and that will release it. And you just pull it out. And uh, when you want to put it back on, you just make sure that it's fully extended and, and away you go. So it's two of these plastic things, two black bolts, and the... Uh, the uh, top cover okay so final step really is the seat I'm not going to cover that um, the fine and um, putting the plastic covers on I noticed a trick that I use anyways for the plastic covers and that's to leave this as the last step this here because you can actually leverage pushing and pulling the uh, the uh, plastic pieces underneath here as opposed to grabbing it with your hands which I found to be a pain um, so that's pretty much it and um, as you can see there's slots here okay so if you've never done this before um, there you see the slots that's where it slides in it's like an L right and then what I do is I keep all the screws already attached and see how the uh, slots go so you just follow see how they're like an L like that so that's the bottom so you're pushing this way right to lock it in and then uh, on the top, it's just, they're just um, straight. So you have to push in and then in, uh, push um, towards the bike, right, for this. So you push towards the bike for those. And then on the front, I just don't want to drop my, yeah, there goes one anyway, too. See, and then here, you see, they're just, let me just, see, they just will snap in, 